So today we're going back way to my roots. We're just going to go ahead and make a nice hard trap beat. Yeah, I just want to keep things simple today. Starting with building a real nice authentic sounding melody completely from scratch. And then we'll flip it, add some crazy hard drums on it to make it into a banger. So if you've got beat block or you just want to know how to make some hard trap beats, then this is definitely the video for you. So let's get into it. As I said, we're going to try and keep this thing sounding nice and authentic. And to do that, I'm going to use this VST called Capsule. Yeah, the good people over at Soundslate was kind enough to send this one out to me. So big shout out to them for sponsoring this one. It's kind of like an all-in-one VST. We've got all all of these different sounds you can pick from. There's this one called Circuit City. It's got like a kind of futuristic kind of sound to it. I think that's a good one if you're making like yee -ye kind of synthetic type beats. Aeolus Solo Bank. I think I'll definitely be using this one in this beat. And I think another one we'll definitely be using is just Heart Strings. Get some real nice harp sounds in there. Arco Solister. And some nice strings in here, man. Got some nice woodwinds. I love my woodwinds, so yeah, we can definitely use something in here. Yeah, nice one. Stratus Drip. Right, these are kind of trippy too. Sanctus. Bro, we have to use this bike. Real like epic choir vibes. Jesus. Salt piano. Yeah, I like this one. Aeolius. Yeah, some more nice brass in this one. Tyrette. I like that one man, that's got like a nice, almost like kalimba kind of feel to it. Onyx, I think this is more of a bass bang. Ripple, 60s Jamaica, I like the side of that. Arco Classico. Solid gold. Yeah, just nice and clean piano tones. Black Ivory, I've got some nice like grand piano vibes in this one. Yeah, I like that cassette one. That's hard. Arco Nuovo. Yeah, these are nice sounds. What we got in grip? Bass. Yeah, got some nice basses in here. Ether. Exodus. Man, there's tons in here, man. Yeah, I like that a bunch of these presets are kind of stacked up, you know, they're not just like one simple signal. There's like, you know, different textures going on in each preset. And then the last one I think is called... <laughs> Well, I almost said rectal there, Jesus. Recital, 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 one of those. It's like some nice vintage keys. Yeah, so man, we are spoiled for choice when it comes to sound selection for the melody. If you want to try out Capsule for yourself, then now's a really good time to do that because all those banks we've just ran through have all been bundled into the Everything Bundle. It's going to allow you to get the entire Capsule catalog at over 65% off. Crazy value for money. So if you're trying to get a VST that's basically got you covered for every kind of sound, then this is a cool option for you. But yeah, be quick though, because they're only running this sale from the 17th of July to August the 21st. But yeah, let's get this cooking look, man. As I said, I want to make something just nice and authentic. So we'll start off with some basic some keys and then we'll build our way up and just add some crazy sounds. I'm going to come into the felt piano. We'll start with a nice G minor chord. Just going to take this middle note, pitch up a whole octave. Yeah, something like that I think. That's kind of hard, you know, catchy. Let's randomize those. I'm just gonna add a bit of half time to it. I'm gonna set it to two bars though. Yeah, these chords are dead simple, just stuck with a G minor chord that kind of runs throughout. And then this little note right here just lets you know that we're about to transition back to the beginning of a bar, like a four bar. So put up another capsule. This time, I think we're gonna go for some kind of brass. So let's come into the Aeolus solo. This double one kind of sounds interesting. Yeah, it's kind of open. I want to add some more brass into that. Ooh, that sounds sick. Let's have that. Yeah, we need that. We need that. <laughs> That's kind of hard. Yeah, and then it's like more of like a droning sound. So let's try, maybe we'll try a different bank. There was this Aeolus one right here. Sounds like more of like an ensemble kind of bank. So we've got like a whole bunch of brasses playing all at the same time. It'll give us that more epic vibe that I'm looking for. It's hard. Yeah, these stabby chords, man, again, nothing crazy. We've got that G minor chord, but all we've done is left the, the middle note out. We are getting there. Uh, next up, I'm thinking of some vocals. Man, the sounds are like... 
it's so deep. Yeah, I really want to get this heart bank in here as well at some point. So we'll try this heart string preset. <laughs> I'm imagining playing the, the harp. You know, where you just see people like, this is the worst fucking example ever, but when they just like, basically just do that on the harp and it makes that like really like luxurious kind of sound. That's what I'm thinking. So to do that, basically just run up the scale. It's fading a little bit with the velocities. Yeah, this harp sounds crazy, man. Just a bit of low end in there, man. That could work, you know. That's hard, man. And that's the whole loop, I think. I just bounced out as a wave file. And so what we're gonna do is, first of all, play with the pitch. So I'm taking a pitching it down. Try it up. It's nice and clear. Should make it sound a bit like more detuned. Slow it right down. It's like 120 BPM, 118 maybe. It's time for drums, man. So we're gonna come into my Zenith bundle, into the drum kit. Honestly, something as simple as that. Boom, we got a hi-hat right there. Clap. But that's kind of hard, you know? Just two sounds so far. Okay, let's get an open hat. Like this immaculate one, but I'm gonna reverse it, take the length down, and then have it just like. And then we'll just get a normal open hat. Put it on the one, make it short though. Just hit. Yeah, that's hard. Now we've got a nice repetitive bounce that we can we can build off. Now we can go off of that with some perks. Yeah, it's hard. And then maybe just a very simple snare. Yeah, like a little double hit at the end. <laughs> That's hard. That kind of bounces off the perk crazy. And then we're gonna go with an eight to eight man. <sighs> Getting wheezy vibes, so I'm gonna go for like a Z. Then I'll give you some secret sauce. Just gonna keep it like that, I think. And now the sauce, the secret sauce that I was gonna be telling you. It's not a secret, but I've been doing it in the last few beats and it really does like spice up the low end. And that is to use two 808. So we've got this main one, but now I'm gonna go find like a softer, more like supplementary 808 just to fill in the gaps. It keeps the low end a bit bouncier, but it doesn't overfill it. It doesn't make it too busy to the point where a rapper couldn't do anything on it. So I'm gonna come into capsule Onyx, I think it was, yeah. Something as simple as that. Ba -ba 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 -ba. That's hard, man. That's hard. Bro, that is so hard, man. That's a hard beat right there. Little pause. It's with the choir, crazy. Man. Yeah, hard beat, man. Messing with that. Let me know what you guys think of this beat. Key thing for these trap beats, just keep it simple. Yeah, I hope there was some sauce in there for you guys to take home, learn from. But yeah, that's gonna be it from me, people. Peace.